Okay, so in the previous video, I actually showed how Bazite can run games easily with Steam out of the box. So I just want to quickly show how I did it. So I did it on Proxmox. So obviously, if you have Bazite installed on hardware, you don't have to do it. But um, I've installed the VM on Proxmox. And in order to actually run a game, on hardware you have to do a pass through so you have to pass through your gpu straight to this exact vm now in order to do that you have to first just do a few things so say you don't have the vm installed already uh first go to your node and then open a shell open a proxmox shell Right, so let's just minimize this quickly. Uh, this is GPU, uh, chat GP, GP, chat GPT, <laughs> helping me with that. Anyway, so first you have to add to the grub. So let's nano. So I've done this before. Just want to see now, just want to show you how to do it. So paste those nano. Etsy default grub, so you can go into the grub a file, right? And then you go to this one here. So, grub command line Linux default where it says quiet. Now I've got some other stuff in there, I've got swaps and all that in there, but I think I've appended it. You can just append stuff. Uh, how does it go? yeah okay yeah so just ignore that so what you will see is you just have to add uh after the quiet so mine my system is amd so i've entered amd underscore i o m m u equals on and then space i o m m u equals p t now it doesn't say in mine exactly like that but uh yeah that's strange but it still works but I entered the right one so i'll leave these commands uh and these settings in the description anyway right so once once you've entered that that's the only thing you've in, you, you have to enter there you can save and exit uh let's go save i don't want to i don't want to save it right and so then you have to say update grub because you have to update that so just say update dash grub and it will update that right then we have to load the vfio kernel modules that's what you have to do so just type in nano uh force less it's it's the force less modules so let's do that quickly. Um, paste, let's see. So I've entered mine. So I'll just leave these in the description. Just put them in exactly like that. Save, and that's that. Right, and then you have to blacklist the host drivers. And that will be done with this command to go into the configuration file so obviously i'm amd so blacklist radeon and then blacklist amd gpu so if you're uh, nvidia it will be those top ones but you can i think you can just put all of them in anyway and then once you're done there you can uh whoops update the init ram fs with that command so update all of that stuff once that is done that should be set up to work right let's just leave that so let's go to proxmox so to set up a to set up bazite we can create a vm let me just show you the settings that i've used so I'm just going to call this one Baz because I have one already. So give it a name. 
next and then the is uh, the ISO image obviously and then choose for graphics card you have to choose none because it's going to pass through to an actual panel a screen so you have to have a screen plugged in obviously on your Proxmox machine right machine you're going to use the Q35 the newest and then bias very important use the UEFI for that choose your storage I would not if it doesn't work just disable the pre and roll keys for TP uh, security no not TP what's the security but anyway um, secure boot secure boot okay and then enable camera agent always next right just choose your size if it's bazite with games i went minimum 50 gigs but depends on what games you want to install and so on so you can make it much bigger right so we can just leave everything like this and I go next obviously course I'm just gonna put that in but put in as much as you can and uh, oh yeah host <laughs> very important yeah, in type you want to obviously choose the host because you want the host gpu to pass to be passed through next ram i'm just going to leave it to that but you need at least four gig right it's just network stuff you don't have to do anything here to change it right next and then that's that right so that's basically the settings for that if you go to my my bad site go to hardware you can see the bias is UFI Q35 no display and uh, what else hard drive disk and then you have to add the PCI device which is your graphics card so it will pick that up so you just have to say add and you go to um, PCI device you go to raw device and then you choose your device if it's not being picked up yet well then I don't know <laughs> it should be picked up here mine is obviously this old Proxmox machine which is a Kaveri Radeon R7 graphics so that will be mine uh, okay let's just choose that you I uh, want to click primary GPU all functions of that uh, particular GPU ROM bar enabled and PCI Express enabled and you want to add that so that's pretty straightforward and then obviously you want to add keyboards and mouse your keyboard and mouse so again just add USB device you go to USB vendor device ID and you choose your keyboard and mouse so this is my keyboard and mouse says keyboard and optical mouse you could create one for your keyboard and create one for your mouse then this one is just for a USB a flash drive that I've created and uh, yeah that should be it that's all I did and it should start up so when you start it uh, let's just start it. It won't display here because you haven't choose a uh, the VNC or Spice Viewer. Because this is through the web UI, it will actually now start on the on the screen itself. Yeah, as you can see, Bazite is starting up there on my Proxmox machine screen screen and I've plugged in there let's see why is it so reflecting mouse mouse is working there is bazite 
PC is a bit slow, Proxmox machine. As you can see there was my previous video, there was the game that I've ran, old Half-Life 1 type of game. And just click on the start menu. Yeah. So yeah, it will show on the panel because it passes through the graphics card straight to that screen. And obviously VNC won't work here. I don't know why I'm using the phone now, but anyway, it's easier. As you can see, there's no spice. VNC is not working. Yeah. Okay, so... Yeah, that's basically that. GPU pass-through. Good. 